back here for Tottenham. Fia and Crooks. Hubble now making a third. Oh, what a fair shot! And well granted about the fourth attempt by Pat Jennings, but he really rifled that across. And Pat Jennings made a good stop. And then, with apparent nonchalance, made two or three grabs before getting it firmly under his control. Obviously deliberate handball. Archibald makes the run, gets in behind, Crooks! Well, that's the best combination between the two. The early run by Archibald got in behind the defence, and Crooks is denied by Pat Jennings. Here, Crooks! And again, the shot from the angle. Uh, Crooks obviously thought that Jennings touched it, but a goal kick has been given. Much of all, the player nearest to just finding the turning touch. And the referee wants the wall further back than it is at the moment. Spurs with three players to the left of the wall, right as we look, and that's Huddle shot, and this is Villiers, and this is Archibald's. And he's the one that looks the unhappiest at the end. Jennings doing well with the earlier part. And Archibald with the easiest opportunity, from the stand at least, put it up over the top. All win playing for Spurs. Here's Graham Ricks. And here's Price, and the goalkeeper caught in two lines. And Price gets in for really the simplest goal to put Arsenal ahead. How he got there completely unmarked to a cross ball, Spurs will certainly want to know, Kendall will certainly want to know, because within 22 seconds of the kickoff, Arsenal, who were on the rack at the end of the first half, are in front at the start. Brooks. Here, Crooks just inside. Oh, well played and well saved. Came inside of here and hit the ball at a time when Jennings may not have had a clear view of it. The goalkeeper down comfortably enough. Ricks. Back again. And Ricks got completely away from Glenn Hoddle then. To get down. Hewton took his eye off it. And one ball from Wicks, but stapled it in for number two. Well, I said earlier in the match that Arsenal are never more dangerous than when they're being pinned in in their own end. And a goal of such simplicity. One ball by Ricks of, what, 40 yards, maybe more. They put Stapleton in, and he finished in style, just placing it over the goalkeeper who came to meet it. Passed it down by Taylor. Oh, and a classic catch. And where well he might look. Ricks, Kendall to meet him. Well, they look and complain on the Arsenal bench. But a three-goal victory would surely be rubbing considerable salt into Tottenham's wounds. trying to get Taylor in, Cooks, Archibald, the turn, lovely turn, Taylor, but the easiest of saves from Pat Jennings at the finish.
And Jennings is the last to touch the ball. Terry Neal side have done it over his old club again by two goals to nothing. Keith Birkinshaw offers his hand in congratulation. Graham Ricks, the architect of both goals, scored by Price and by Stapleton.